Hey everybody, I am here today to answer the simple question of what do the numbers on a toaster mean? I'll give you an easy explanation for these numbers on the toaster, so let's get right into the video. <clears throat> so the numbers that I'm referring to are right here on this toaster, and on pretty much every toaster that I've ever seen, there are some numbers that you can control basically how long the toaster is on for. However, a lot of people assume that these are based on a time. So a lot of people assume that if I put this to five, that means that the toaster will stay on for five minutes, and that is just incorrect. I'm gonna tell you what it really means right now, but first I'm gonna turn the camera to myself so you can sort of see me and you don't have to stare at the toaster the entire time. So just bear with me and I'm gonna zoom out. I think this is zoomed in. Oh, there we go, let's zoom out. There we go, that's a bit better. So essentially, when you see a number on a toaster, it basically translates to the amount of toastedness of the thing that you're putting in there. So for instance, on this toaster, if I was to put it at the number one, okay, it would make the bread that I put in there, not that toasty, okay? Woo, there's lots of crumbs that just came out from under this. I brought the vacuum down. I'm in my, I'm actually in my basement washroom and I brought the vacuum down to clean it up, but I'm definitely gonna clean this toaster um, now that I see how many crumbs are coming out of the bottom of it. Okay, but that's, that's an aside. Clean your toaster, that's what you should do for sure. But other than that, with regards to the numbers, trying to stay on topic over here, um, it means that a number one would mean less toasted, and something like a number six or seven would mean the most toasted. It doesn't translate to time. There's no timer in the toaster um, that, 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 that when you put it in a number five, it doesn't mean five minutes because there's no timer in there. Now there are certain toasters that have timers in them that will give you a certain uh, countdown and that's a different type. But if you're talking about just a number, essentially what happens is it controls, that dial controls how much current or how much electricity is going through the toaster. And it's counterintuitive in the sense that a lower number means more electricity is going through the toaster. So by putting the toaster number to a lower number, more electricity goes through the toaster, which therefore heats up the off switch faster, therefore turning it off faster. <clears throat> and vice versa is true as well. So if you put it to a higher number, less current goes through the toaster, therefore it takes longer to heat up that off switch, therefore it takes longer to turn the toaster off. So that's basically it. Um, obviously, like I said, some toasters do have a timer in them. Other toasters have a, have a number, but basically um, it'll just give you a time to when it will go up. So, but most toasters, when it just has a number, it doesn't mean the time that's remaining. It's just translating to essentially how much current or, or changing the level of current going through the toaster, therefore letting the object in their toast for longer or shorter before the off switch triggers. That's it. Honestly, I saw a whole bunch of content on toasters being, uh, the numbers being how much time it is. And, you know, as far as I understand, it's not true. It's obviously a four is going to be more than a two. It's going to stay out for longer, but a four doesn't mean four minutes and a two doesn't mean two minutes. It's just the amount of current going through, um, triggering the off switch earlier or later. And that's basically it. I just wanted to explain it in this video. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.